Hello everyone, what's up, what's up? This is again the online teacher blog and we have another short blog video which is entitled How to Pay Two Bills Payment for BPI Film Life at BPI Bank A step-by-step -step process and this is our topic of the day But before anything else, please click the notification bell icon so you will be updated every time we have our new topic and also click the subscribe button like and share so let's start now first thing you need to do before entering the bank is to fill up the health declaration form and be sure that the guard check your temperature then they will allow you to enter and do your business transaction Second thing you need to do is to go to BEA or also known as BPA Express Assist. Then prepare your account number so you can input it on the screen. Tap the screen of BEA or the Express or BPI Express Assist to start. Under transaction selection, please do the transaction that you want to do. Since we will pay the two bills payment for BPA Film, then select the bar on bills payment. Under merchant selection, please select the bar under BPA Film Live since we will pay a bills payment for this account. So this is the selection that you want to do uh, to pay and there is also other merchants here in policy and insurance life so this is the bar of bpi film life to be exact simply click this bar to proceed for the moment you see the screen please enter the reference number in a numerical way enter your 10 digit re reference number by touching the numbers on the screen the number of digits are depends upon the account or plan that you have then click the next button at the right side bottom of the screen. Then please select the type of transaction that you want. If you have only cash, then click cash bar. If you only have check, then click the check bar. And if you both have cash and check, then click the cash and check bar. Under the cash amount, please enter the total amount of your cash transaction by touching the numbers on the screen. Your decide amount must be based upon the money or cash or check that you have or the amount that you wanted to or the required amount of payment that you need to fulfill. So just click the number on the screen here depends upon your will. Then click the next bar at the right side bottom of the screen. Under the transaction details confirmation, please confirm the transaction details below. Please read carefully all the details that you input to avoid mistakes. If you wish to conceal it due to wrong information that you input earlier, then simply click the conceal bar. But if every information is doing well, like the types of transaction is correct, reference number are all good and the cash amount is with an exact amount or the check amount then you can now proceed to the next step then click the next bar at the right bottom of the screen to continue then the question do you have another transaction will appear by this time it's your decision to continue if whether you click yes or no if you have another transaction but you have multiple accounts to pay then click the yes bar button but if you don't have any additional transaction then just simply click no your your key number will appear on the screen inside the bar section that start with letter n with number you can now get your key number slip below the next thing that you need to do is to proceed to the teller when your QUI number is called. Also a friendly reminder that we need to transact our business only with the teller at the counter. In this section, the QUI number will automatically pop up then just simply get your QUI number here. Just simply get your QUI number here then you can now take a set for a moment. 
while waiting for the number to be called by the teller. So just confirm that the QI number on the screen and the one that's in your hand are the same. Then you can click the OK button at the right button of the screen. This is now your confirmed QI number, then you can add another transaction if you wish to. Or whenever you remember or recall that you need to have an additional transaction because of some reason, then you simply tap the screen to start all over again. To start another transaction, just do the same procedure that we did lately. Just simply tap the screen to start again. Do the same procedure if you wish to do the same additional transactions, like clicking the bills payments under transaction selection. Then click the BPA Film Life bar under merchant selection. Enter the reference number by touching the number on the screen. Simply click the next bar to proceed to the next part. Just choose the desired type of transaction that you want such as cash, check or both cash and check. Upon clicking the cash bar, please enter the total amount of your cash transaction by hundreds or by thousands. Then simply click the next bar at the right side bottom of the screen. Read all tr the transaction details for confirmation, such as the type of transaction, the reference number, the cash amount or check amount if any. Then if you notice that some information is wrong, you can click the cancel bar to continue the process or simply click the next bar at the right side bottom to continue. When every details are all good, then simply click the next bar at the right side bottom of the, of the screen to continue into the next page. If you still have any transaction to follow, just cl simply click yes at the yellow bar but if you don't have any additional transaction, then simply click no at the red color. Then the QE number will appear at the screen with N letter and number. Please get your QE number slip below. Then finally, you can now proceed to the teller when your QE number is called. Reminder, transact your business only with a teller at the counter. Get your second queen number here. This is now your second queen number. You can now sit at the chair and wait for your number to be called and proceed to the teller for the moment that the teller will call your queen number. Simply sit or sit on the chair and wait for your number to be called. Then go to the teller and do, do the transaction. While waiting for your number to be called, just prepare your health declaration form that you already fill up upon entering the bank. Also, your two QI numbers to confirm that you are the next person in the line. Then prepare also the cash or money that you will pay for the bill's payment with the same amount that you tap on the screen a while ago. When you called, Give to the teller your health declaration form as well as the QI number and the cash amount that you have. Proceed to the counter the moment your QI number will be called. After you pay at the counter, the teller will give you the two receipts to you with printed information at the bottom. Check all the details before you go to confirm if all the details that inputted by the teller are all correct. Then set your change or get your change if there is any. Then you can now leave the counter. Double check the details if all are correct. Then if it's all good or ready, then you can now leave and go back home. Check the amount the date, reference number, the name of the person, the type of transaction like cash or check and the time. If it's all good, then have a smile on your face. Congratulations, mission accomplished. Your transactions had just been completed. Have a wonderful day. Thanks for watching to the way, the truth and the life. Jesus Christ be all the honor, praise and adoration. Again, this is the online teacher blog. See you again next time only here in our channel. Bye.